Hello, Miss James. I am going to read a new book that I just got called Lady Pancake and Sir French Toast. Hmm. And it is by Josh Funk and illustrated by Brenda Kearney. So we got Pancake right here, Lady Pancake, and Sir French Toast. Just, I love pancakes and French toast, by the way. Do you? I love breakfast food. Oh my goodness, I could eat it all the time. Okay. Ah, I'm going to get hungry reading this book. Deep in the fridge and past or behind the green beans, way past the tofu and left of the cheese, up in the corner and back by a roast sat Lady Pancake beside Sir French Toast. The leftover friends were as close as could be until they heard the news from their neighbor, Miss Bree. The syrup is almost completely all gone. A single drop's left. Just a drop, she went on. The last drop is mine, Lady Pancake conversed. But French Toast replied, not if I get there first. Like that, he was off and the race had begun with Pancake behind breaking into a run. <gasps> a race to get that last drop of syrup. Through broccoli forest past orange juice fountain, they climbed to the top of potato mash mountain, pushing and shoving. They fought for the lead, toast behind Pancake, who rolled at high speed. Got the broccoli forest in the orange juice fountain and look at the mashed potato mountain. <laughs> I really are gonna get hungry reading this. She screeched to a stop at the edge of the shelf, clutching a grapevine to steady herself. Toast didn't notice and couldn't quite stop plummeting down into jam with a plop. Uh-oh, plop, right into the jam. He scraped himself off and yelled, You're a meanie! As Pancake repelled down a rope of linguine, she bragged, oh, I'm the best of all breakfast food treats. Then hurdled the lime and skipped over two beets. <laughs> There's a lot of leftovers in this fridge. You notice that? <laughs> I am, thought Toast, but his chances looked bleak. So Toast took a shortcut down Sauerkraut Peak, skiing spa past spinach and artichoke dip. Toast vaulted high in the air with a flip. Ooh. Nearing the edge, he tried one final jump, but stumbled and fell way below with a thump. Pancake made use of her seafaring skills and sailed across oceans of soup causing spills. <laughs> but Chili Lagoon slathered Pancake in muck and then at a fork in the road, she got stuck. Ooh, and Chili. yelled a cheek pee to warn her. But Pancake sped on and got trapped in a corner. Uh-oh. <gasps> Caught behind dressings, one Russian, one ranch. She squeezed out and started a bean avalanche. <laughs> Toast reemerged in the vegetable crisper, <gasps> sneaking up swiftly. Beans were now falling from such a great height. Some kidney, some llama, some pinto, and some white. My, beans going everywhere. Searching for safety from raining legumes, Toast turned to hide, but was blasted by fumes. A Brussels sprouts left from an old party plaster, platter. Ooh, mm. so quickly he climbed a celery ladder. Beside him, a lettuce leaf parachute landed and Pancake flipped out. It is mine, she demanded, battered and soggy, exhausted and crumbling, too tired to push. They were limping and stumbling. Oh my. <laughs> there stood the bottle of syrup at last. 
his lips <clears throat> made a sneer that was awful. Out of the shadows crept Baron von Waffle. I got here first while you boasted and bickered. My, that syrup was delicious. Mm -hmm. He snickered <laughs> with one evil laugh. -ha -ha -ha! Waffle slipped out of sight. The syrup was gone, no more reason to fight. Trudging back home beneath layers of grime, Toe said, perhaps we should not fight next time. <laughs> Agreed, replied Pancake. As friends, we should share. Hey, look, we can split that butter right up there. Boop, butter, my favorite, I love butter. <laughs> And there they are, good friends, splitting that butter. They settled for butter since they didn't have any syrup. It's a silly, funny book, but I like how the um, author chose different things in the refrigerator, like they were traveling through the refrigerator. That was pretty cool. And um, I think they might need to clean out the refrigerator because that's a lot of stuff in the fridge. <laughs> so, all right, I hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you next time.